Namaskar, Suresh Yadesi here. Today, I am going to uh, tell you about the fundamental duties of Indian Constitution. Indian Constitution was framed from 9th December 1946 to 24th uh, November 1949, means in the period of 2 years, 11 months and 18 days. In uh, this original constitution, there uh, were 395 articles, 22 parts and 8 schedules. So, uh, in this uh, whole constitution, the different provisions, laws, etc. for the administration and the political system of India was explained or described. But as this video is concerned, I am going to tell you about the fundamental duties mentioned in Indian Constitution. So, uh, first of all, I would like to tell you that uh, there was no mention of fundamental duties in the original Constitution of India. Means, the Constitution which was ad adopted in 1949, there were no fundamental duties mentioned in the Constitution. Later, uh, during uh, when Indira Gandhi was the Prime Minister of India in 1976, a committee was formulated under the chairmanship of Sardar Swan Singh and this committee recommended eight fundamental duties for India. Later, Government of India included ten fundamental duties by the 42nd Amendment Act 1976 in the 4th part, 4th A part of Indian Constitution and uh, the articles which were in, in, uh, inculcated or incorporated in Indian Constitution was 51A. So in this article means 4th part, part 4, article 51A, part 4A, the fundamental duties were included in the Indian Constitution. So, uh, basically, in the initiation, at the initiation level of Indian Constitution, there were no provision of fundamental duties, but later, by the 42nd Amendment Act 1976, 10 fundamental duties were included in Indian Constitution on the recommendations of Sardar Swan Singh Committee. And I would also like to tell you that these funda the concept of fundamental duties is basically taken or inspired uh, is taken from former Soviet Union. Uh, one more thing I would like to share with you that uh, 6th January in India is celebrated as Fundamental Duties Day. Later, by the 86th Constitution, uh, Constitutional Amendment Act 2002, the 11th fundamental duty is also inclu included in the section of fundamental duties means 51A. So uh, now at present there are 11 fundamental duties. So I am going to read these fundamental duties for you now one by one. The first fundamental duty is every citizen will every citizen of india will abide by the constitution and respect national flag and national anthem fundamental duty to follow every citizen will follow ideals of the freedom struggle every citizen indian citizen will protect sovereignty and integrity of india for every citizen of india will defend the country and render national services when called upon Fifth, every citizen of India will have developing, will develop the spirit of common brotherhood. Next, uh, fundamental duty is, every citizen of India will preserve composite culture of the country. Next, every citizen of India will preserve natural environment. Next, every citizen of India will develop scientific temper and humanity. Fundamental duty number 9. Every citizen of India will safeguard public property and avoid violence. Duty number 10. Every Indian citizen will strive for excellence in all spheres of life. Duty number 11. 
it is duty of every guardian or parent to send their children in the age group of 6 to 14 years to school for completing the primary education. So these 11 fundamental duties are there and these are include, uh, included in Indian constitution to balance the concept of rights and duties and every citizen of India has some duties towards the nation and they are mentioned in these fundamental duties. Jai Hind, Jai Bharat.